Hey guys, it's Sunday. Um, finishing up my birthday. One of my gifts, so I was going to do kind of like switching my work bag, what's in my work bag. But Evan got me the Whipping Post tote bag. I really wanted this for my birthday. I don't know if you can see, he had it engraved with my initials PS. And then on this side, it says Whipping Post tote. I'll leave a link for it down below. I have one of these bags forever. They're made here in Texas, if I'm not mistaken. I think so. They smell so good. And the leather is amazing on this. But I'm switching out of this big old Louis Vuitton bag. Great bag, but I wanted this one. It's a smaller bag, which I need to carry a smaller bag. So let's go through this and see what's all in this one. I have a journal that says do something creative every day. It's from Paper Source. It's a store here in town. And it's just, let's not do that page. It's just actually blank pages. No lines, and I like this because you can just kind of write wherever you want to. I have a Louis Vuitton bag, this one. It's a cosmetic bag, if I'm not mistaken. And this thing is cram packed. It's been couple weeks since I've cleaned anything out. So this thing is full. Most of the stuff I don't need to carry, like full bottles. I have a bottle of Lacrosse Cologne. I'm trying to finish it up. I've been having bad headaches, so some etc. migraine. A watch band that's actually like a strap. That goes to my Apple Watch. And then uh, pretty much baby wipes to clean off your hands and stuff. Or like well, I use these for like toilet seats and out in public, like even when we go to a restaurant, wipe down the table because I don't, I'm not real sure how good they clean the tables. Granola bar, love these. Um, blotting sheets. Another granola bar. Um, hand lotion. It looks like a tube of hair color. I love this lotion. It smells so good. It's called, it's by Davinus. Mints from like Steinmark. Um, water flavoring. Tissues. Beats headphones. Just little ones. I keep these mostly just for emergencies. Like if I need just a pair of headphones for my wireless ones are dead. Very random, clean plastic fork. Never know when you're gonna need that. Breast spray, Listerine strips. A pumpkin cupcake hand sanitizer from Bath and Body Works. Just trying to finish this one off. Regular hand sanitizer, just from the hospital. Evan doesn't like the pumpkin spice ones. Keys for a lockbox at work. This is a Brighton Angel that I gave to my grandmother probably 15 years ago for her, her birthday. And then when she passed away, she always kept it pinned to the inside of her pillow. And I found it when we were cleaning out everything and I've carried it with me for at least eight years now I think it's when she passed so yeah um just some hand lotion that came in a burst box lip balm not a fan of this one I don't think I'll put that back in there but I'm gonna go through everything and then I'm gonna show what I'm putting back in my Filofax A5 planner still love this planner it can still smell the leather. It's getting scratched on it, but it gives it character. And the leather is super soft. I'll definitely put that back in. Um, iPad. Always carry this with me. Just basic iPad, nothing fancy. Another Louis Vuitton pouch. This has pins in it for my planner. I don't think I'm going to carry this anymore, or these pins. Or this, I'm not real sure because I very rarely use this. I mostly do sticky notes like on my planner and then go back and fill it in. My Hobonichi Cousin Spring Edition for 2017. This starts April, so I'm fixing to start using this one. 
very excited about that. I'll let y'all know how that goes. Another pack of pens. You would think I'm an artist with all the pens I carry. I have my journal, and then I have multiple sections in here. I don't want to show, there's some personal information. I have notes and things to do in one. The other one is, um, I can show this one, Project Me. And then the other one actually has my home address, but it has repair people, login passwords, all kinds of stuff for the house, um, pool company, yard people, all that stuff. But this is kind of like a catch-all journal. And then self-promotion, my YouTube card with all of my information on the back, which is all listed below. A couple dollars. That's what's been jingling in here. A ton of change. I always carry three different pens. I carry a Mont Blanc pen. It's hard to see, sorry guys. It's black and silver checkered. A regular pen, in case somebody needs to borrow one, because they're not getting a good one. And then a mechanical pencil. And those are the two pockets that were in here. Then chapstick and a pack of gum. So, that is this bag and it's dirty on the inside. I put it in its dust bag and clean that up. Okay, so, with this one, let's take the tag off. I literally just opened this today for my birthday. I'm filming on my new camera that my parents got me for my birthday. It is a Canon PowerShot G7X. There we go. Super excited about this camera. It was one that I wanted for a while and my parents gave it to me. Oh, I normally have a backup charger in there, but it's charging right now. So let's repack this bag. I am going to put the wet wipes, back in for sure, pack of tissues, my little angel, keys for work, let's do, let's just do one, one sanitizer, I don't need the fork, extra headphones, let's do one lotion, we'll take out the other, we'll do the breath sprays, and the e.l.f. blotting sheets. The rest of the stuff, the mint, the mint tin actually has etc. migraine in it and a couple other pills, so I'll put that in there. And that's all that's going in here. I'm gonna keep this one very light and simple. So, inside of my whipping post, it's just a big bucket, it's empty, there's nothing in here. And there's only one big pocket right here that you can put stuff in. And then that is the only pocket. So I guess it sits like this. Let's go bigger items first. So all I'm gonna carry in here is my iPad, my planner. I might actually leave that planner at home my journal Oops, I can go back here and I'll put this in here and I really think that's all I want to carry because this I don't end up using as much as I thought I would like everyday use Um, let's see. I really think that's what I'm going to carry in here. I don't need all those pins. If I do anything, I might carry this. I really don't need to carry this anymore. I'm looking. Oh. And then here's my backup charger. I got this one on Amazon. It's a power bank. It does my iPhone 7 Plus, I want to say like three times. There is a thing for it to carry in, and I don't remember what I did with it. 
Oh, I will do my pins. Let's see what can go in this little pocket here. I don't want to scratch it yet. I'm going to put my three ones in that little pouch. I want my pen. You know what? I'm just going to drop my pins in there because I don't want to clip them on there. My chapstick I use all the time. I'm going to put in that pouch because that way I don't have to be digging around in that other one. Gum. I have a smaller pack. I'm trying to, I'm trying to not carry as much. So, so I am again transferring out of a Louis Vuitton into my whipping post tote that I got for my birthday. Much lighter now. And that Louis Vuitton bag is great. But it gets... You know what? I still have a ton of room in here. I really do. <sighs> I hate to say this. I might carry this. If I don't use it this week, I'll take it out. Granola bars, I normally just leave in my car because these don't have any, these are just the honey oats. They don't have any chocolate or anything in it that will melt. So these I'm going to just leave in my car and grab them when I need it. I, I need to put that back in there. Most of the time I just drink plain water, but occasionally you want that. And that is all that I'm putting in my bag. So I really don't know if I got, I did, I took out. I guess I took out a couple things. It's much lighter, so that's all that matters. Um, on another note, I had an excellent birthday. Um, got to spend it with family and friends. Um, love all the messages I received from everybody on Instagram and Facebook for my birthday. I appreciate everybody taking time to wish me happy birthday. Um, besides that, another big gift from Evan is our cruise in October. We are going out of Galveston in Texas and going to Jamaica, or Cozumel, Jamaica, and Cayman Islands. And we're doing a seven day Royal Caribbean cruise, so we're very excited. I will definitely film all that. And I think I'm gonna do, we don't go until October, so I've got plenty of time. But we're starting to purchase things for the trip, and I'm gonna kind of do a vlog or like a little series on that part on what we purchased like our packing cubes and different things that we're packing just because I know a lot of people are always interested on in what people take on a cruise um don't forget to follow me on Instagram and Twitter I'm in of course snapchat I post on snapchat regularly so don't forget to follow me on those and I just want to say thank you all so much for helping with my channel growing I hope this year will be filled with a lot more excitement. I can't talk, I'm tired. Um, and just things that's going on. Um, besides that, Mr. Figaro, our little Yorkie, was um, a little sick today and had to go to the emergency clinic and he's doing better. He um, had a gland rupture and it was very uncomfortable for him, but he is doing great now. He's just on some painkillers and some antibiotics. Love our vet. But besides that, it was an easy day. We did family dinner tonight at one of my favorite restaurants, Chef Point. It's actually a gas station. It was filmed on Diners, Dives, and I can't remember the name of his show. And Paula Dean visited it and talked about it and all that as well. So, great little restaurant. It is truly in a gas station, but it's a very high-end type restaurant now. I mean, they serve very odd foods too, but great place to go. If you're ever in North Texas, do go to Chef Point. It's really good. But besides that, that is it. Um, truly blessed to be alive for another year. And 33 is going to be a great year for me. There's a lot in store and a lot of changes coming this way, so I can't wait. I will talk to y'all tomorrow. I'm going to get ready for bed and call it quits because Monday is right around the corner. Y'all have a great one. Don't forget to subscribe. Bye, guys.